Hi, this is Benjamin on the Texas Micro Center. Would you like to see the new Asus Vivo tab? Stay tuned. Thanks for joining us. This is the unboxing of the Asus Vivo tab running the Windows 8. And open up. Take the tablet outside of the box here. You see it comes with a bunch of accessories. We have a nice manual. Gives us the basics of how to use Windows 8. And how to navigate. And some more information. All the accessories that it comes with. USB docking cable, USB dongle, USB charger, those I'll be showing. It's something you will have to use and keep hold of. This is the cleaning cloth. It gets all those nasty fingerprints off. Here is the USB charger. There's the USB port in there. This is you plug into the side of the wall. You'll be using this cable. This side plugs into the wall. And this into the uh, tablet itself. Other USB adapter. Okay. Now to turn the tablet on, it's asking to select your language. So we're going to choose English. And then click Next. Country, Region. All defaults fine. Click next. Licensing terms. Got to check the box by touching it. And accept. Personalize. Keep everything to, for PC name. Just going to call it PC. Keep it simple. This is wireless. We're going to connect to a wireless network later. Let's go ahead and set up the computer now. And use Express settings. The touch is very, very nice in this computer. And when the uh, keyboard comes up, it's very easy to use. So username is just going to be John Doe. Enter. And we set no password. As you can see, the tablet itself is giving us some instructions of how to pull up the charms by swiping to the side. That allows you to get into things like settings, uh, turn it off, things of that nature. And here we are now that we have everything set up, so we're going to go ahead and open up an app, for example. Uh, all apps open full screen, though you have to have a Microsoft account to use apps. Now, if you already have an Xbox Live account or a Hotmail account, you can sign in with that. Uh, to close an app, basically you just, uh, with your finger, click and drag from the top on down, and as you see, that closes it. That's the same thing with, like, Internet Explorer any app that you may have open. and the, um, the default apps are Mail. Now this is uh, a different from Windows Live Mail. It's a separate mail application. Uh, it works with IMAP accounts, uh, POP3 accounts. It is not compatible with. So you'll have to check with your internet service provider to see which account that you have. Alright. And to get to the desktop, there is a desktop app that allows you to kind of open up your desktop and work in a traditional Windows environment and you can basically pull up Internet Explorer that way click on start, basically pull up the charms from the side, go to start, that will bring you back to the modern user interface now with the charms you can get into PC settings and if we wanted to join a wireless account there's a wireless button there we can change sound, we can click on power, choose sleep, shut down, restart um, and go to notifications, go down to change PC settings and go to general for example and change apps touching, change the keyboard, go to spelling, screen, language and you can even, re if you want to, reinstall Windows 8 by remove everything and reinstall by clicking there. Once again to close it, touch at the top and swipe all the way down. And we're going to get a little bit of what uh, the Asus Vivo tab has in regards to ports on the side. Now as far as ports on the Asus Vivo tab, we have the uh, micro SD card reader, we have the power right there for the uh, power connection. 
we have the headphone jack to put in headphones, listen to music, and on the back side we have the outward facing camera to use the camera app to take your photos. Well, thanks for watching for the unboxing of the Aces Vivo Tab. For more information on Windows 8, please visit us at uh, microcentertech.com. And for more information on the Vivo Tab itself, please visit us at microcenter.com.